What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Ari. Welcome back to AM on Advice. Hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing great. Today, I'm doing a reaction video on Jeffree Star making other people feel poor for 10 minutes. I don't understand that. People, somebody in the comment section down below, explain this to me. Why are people like Jeffree Star still have a platform and still have an influence on the community? On the black community is that too, right? If you guys saying, oh, we're doing this for justice, why is Jeffree Star still up there? Explain that to me. Have anybody ever sat down and listened to the hateful stuff Jeffree Star said in the past? But if it was a black individual, if it was me, or somebody with a close skin color, y'all would have tear them down to the dirt. Y'all would have made sure this person never be able to work back in Hollywood or wherever, ever again. Look, for example, they fired, they, they canceled Wild and Out a whole show off of something they can't say. I'm not saying they can't, wasn't wrong, but they canceled the whole show. Jeffree Star, who called people stupid niggas and, and, and stupid Mexican. Y'all would, y'all, y'all would, so that's cool. That that's cool, but the way how Nick Cannon said his what Nick Cannon said wasn't I mean wasn't that bad. I mean it was bad, but it's okay. Once he apologized, once Jeffrey Star apologized. Oh, I'm sorry. That was the old me, man. Fuck you, nigga. You said what you said. You looked down on the black community. You looked down on black people, and 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 I mean Latinos, and Latinos. It's Latinos and Latinos. The Spanish community. It's crazy, man. It's just like once you're a white person, you, you have this privilege above everybody else. You know? It sucks. With that being said, if you guys are having a good day, like, subscribe, comment, all the good stuff down below. Let's just get the reaction video. Sorry for writing on so early. It's just that I don't understand how something like that could be tolerated. It's like El Torito. Quick to cancel everybody else. <laughs> Yeah, like a big fancy Mexican restaurant. I am poor. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, yeah, Gucci shoes. Those are garbage. <laughs> How much were those? These? I don't know. I don't look. <laughs> all, all sarcasm aside, I don't know about that. But this is a lot of hip ball. Do you actually play all these? Yeah, so this is like a very small portion of our collection. So basically, they were over at where we had like a hundred machines, but this is the, the newest ones that we are obsessed with playing at the moment. Okay. <laughs> so, kitchen. Is that what this is? Yeah. Sorry, the kitchen's so small, so embarrassed. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay. So we've never really shown up our kitchen before. So, is and this the fridge? There's two. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Our fridge is empty, so I'm embarrassed right now. We've been traveling a lot. We just got back from Europe two days ago, so I got like nothing in here. So I'm a little, I'm a little embarrassed. Maybe Gucci luggage. How much was this? Um, I mean this, all the patches and the custom fabric. This is probably like um, maybe three thousand. This is probably like nineteen hundred. And not everyone thinks this stuff is cute. Some people think it's ugly, and that's okay. I would. But is it? But it's supposed to be kind of ugly, right? Like, yeah. How much Gucci stuff do you think you have? In what context? Like, <laughs> do you have like a room, like a Gucci room? Um, it takes up a lot of room. We're building another closet right now. Every spare room in the house is full of only my clothes. Um, you should just build a Gucci store in your house. We're working on it. <laughs> <laughs> so this whole entire mountain connected to our house is all ours over here. Which one? Yeah, this whole. <laughs> That's yours? Yeah. What do you do with it? Is that your pink chair? Like, you just sit and, like... Yeah, so that's the thing about money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, spending $10,000 in 10 minutes in Jeffrey Jones. That's every day, yeah. yeah. That's pretty good. Because, no. <laughs> like, legit, that was crazy. It smells like some fucking oils that I can't afford. Mm, so... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, being so poor is my aesthetic. <laughs> Try to cut into this... Brand new uh, Chanel boy bag. Chanel boy bag. And these retail for about uh, like 5,500 bucks. So oh, I guess yeah. we're just gonna see what happens. I have this to you. Bam, all right, thank you. And I packed all mine. Uh, I use a lot of this, oh, so. God. Of course it's gonna leave a top bag. <laughs> this guy is, it comes all the way from Paris, and this is $120. <laughs> right. Um, 
60 bucks. Oh, okay. Can you even tell the difference? Uh, yeah. <laughs> You want Burberry? No, I'm not tearing up a Burberry. I won't do well, it. Well, what if we don't know if it's going to tear it up. Exactly. That's not what I'm putting it in there. Who cares? All I mean, right. Fine. I, I'm the highest VIB Rouge point person on Sephora. Oh, this fits good. So eyeshadow palettes usually range from like $20 to $40. This is um, $129. <laughs> he shook. Oh, oh my God. God. Look what's in here. Well, I love you just casually have that in your trunk. I ain't gonna lie. Look, that rule says 10. Is that pink? I think I'm like a car. Yeah, this is so you. That's so pretty. Yeah, yeah. They didn't have those in there. That's sparkly. That's this girl got a lot of drafts. <laughs> Even if I were to bring makeup, there wouldn't be a point. Mine's like all dirty and like right. target. I was hoping, like, hoping you would bring it so I can throw it away. Expensive, so every tooth in my mouth is. Don't touch her. Don't touch her, please. Thank you. Putting it um Do you want to try it on? Wait, what? Yeah, okay. This is what Rihanna wore. Oh, and she's so sick and disgusting. Yeah. She's food poisoning. She's perfect. She's sick. So this is a headpiece. Okay. She's... Uh -huh. <laughs> no. Stop. <laughs> Stop it. What? I just saw the pie. Oh, it's not bad. Oh, my God. He's being what? Wait, what? This is all hand Swarovski. It's not bad. 2500 Wait, I'm scared. Okay, wait. It probably won't fit. Holy shit. Yeah, this is crazy. I remember oh, that one, Rihanna. I'm literally oh. wearing rent. Oh my god. I have one. The Boring Company. Oh my god. This is like your own little school. Yeah. Literally, though. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. And, and oh. now we're in here. Yeah. Oh, what, what is this? This is a Dior bag. They only made three of these. Meet Beyonce and Rihanna. Have it. Oh, oh my god. So this is like a lot of limited edition stuff. It's all going to be in the, in the vault soon, but it's, you know, there's just bargains everywhere. <laughs> it's a mess in here. I know, it's, it's disgusting how messy this is. <laughs> What's like the most expensive item you have? A Himalayan Birkin is pretty expensive. This is a collector's item. They make only a few of these a year. And this is from Hermes. You can hold her. <laughs> oh. I like how Hermes. How much is this? Um, that is $125,000. What? <laughs> yeah. oh, no. Paris. These are all collect uh, collectibles. <laughs> we better move your drink um, from now. These go up in value because they're so rare. Uh -huh. So um, these. So here's the thing. You want, you want to talk for real? Yeah. Man to man, <laughs> black people might be like. Well, I wouldn't put that. <laughs> right. We don't put that deal. Not next to the new line, Birkin bitch. <laughs> Huge investment. It's like buying property, which I have a lot of property as well. I love investing. That's my thing. I'm a businessman. How much do you think if you added up everything in this room? Oh god. <laughs> How much do you think it is? In just this room? That's at least a slow ten. So if you were to five, 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 and everything in this room, I don't know, maybe five, like six, seven million. See how close. I said five. <laughs> Clothes. <laughs> luxury items. So, yeah. um, uh, man, so much, so much, let's clean your house to do it. <laughs> Just like an entire 10 year salary for most people in makeup in front of us. There's a lot. <laughs> okay, so. This is a Chanel brush. Completely unnecessary to clean this expensive brush. But Why wouldn't we clean expensive brushes? Because we're gonna destroy this beautiful brush. Oh, it's fine. Okay, whatever she says. I love that. Um, no, we. <laughs> Trash. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, let's find a really nice drugstore primer. So we're, all, we're all just gonna use all my shit. Tana's just gonna dive in. So drugstore. <laughs> Jeffrey's right. working. I ain't gonna lie though. Like, yes. I always thought about this. I would do some shit like that. I would do um, makeup. But not makeup. I don't know nothing much about makeup. But I would start a business into that. Like for me, I would let a female be the face and I would just be behind it, pump. You know, just 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 doing stuff like that. I don't know why, cause I feel like that'd be a dope. Like, yo, fellas, y'all ever thought about how much money you could make off of selling wigs and, and makeup? Think about that, fellas. I advise y'all. Try put try investing money into some. I mean, skincare and and makeup. You can get your clothes wearing the fast. Wait, wait, they have seven million dollars in this clothes. Shoot, they're working. 
So they said the, the, the Sicily uh, Double Tensio Instant and Long Term Primer. This is a uh, measly 200. So, you know, you can find this at Walgreens. <laughs> Walgreens just went out of business. Honestly, my, my G Wagon is trash compared to my I really like this Rolls Royce. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I like the I, I like the the black and the pink. You know what I mean? That G Wagon cool too. I don't even know. Like I was like, which is your most expensive pink car? And it was like this one. Like, okay, we're taking this one. Yeah. This was it. I don't know if you get those around here. Uh, <laughs> she no, got her nose job. She got her nose <laughs> Thank you for the, the rich air. Females, question. Y'all think that's look good? Why y'all getting your nose sharp like a damn pigeon for? Oh, damn toucan parrot. That don't look cute. Any yeah. For the first time ever in my life. I need real. The nails or the diamond? Diamond. Yeah, all real. <laughs> I got a purse for me. Jeffrey got a purse for me. <laughs> Trisha said, look honey, you have way too many bags. I said, you're right, but I really need you to have this. Oh my god, I'm so, I like died. Like, the, the woman like, that was checking us out was like, what a good friend. I'm like, yeah, we literally just met today. In this video, we are going to uh, hopefully cut open a $5,000 bag. <laughs> Like really. Well, um, Jason, the broken garden. Edition pink crocodile. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. This is the How much green is this bag. One? Um, that one is like ninety thousand. Oh. Ninety thousand dollars for a bag? <laughs> oh my god! Is that Shut up! Wait a minute. I... This is real real estate. So, well, you know, how much is this bag? This is ninety thousand. Hermes crocodile. Ninety thousand what? Dollars. <laughs> oh, U.S. I got what? I bought a DVD. This is an alligator. Yeah, crocodile. Not alligator. It's crocodile. Did you have the crocodile hand stitch it for you? <laughs> that's a good question. This is the one you looked at. I know. That's the one I wanted. You can't. These are different, but they're just so like. Uh, I would definitely pick this one. This is Nate's car. How much was this? Um, this one was $300,000. Really? Yeah. I paid cash. This is crazy. Like, Cardi B, I got my pizza. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god! Dude! That's a lot of pain. It looks like a cartoon. Yeah. It's sick, the white. It's fake. Ice white leather. Oh, sorry. I know, but he hasn't driven it before. He did. Your Gucci keychain. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a lot of things though. Amazing. Oh! It's brand new. It's just got it in Christmas. Yeah. Okay, LA is like Ferraris, Lambos, Bentley's cute. McLaren is like rare, way more badass. You're gonna get one good. So if you want a convertible, this is the one. He wanted the McLaren and like no one liked it. Everyone talked him out of it. Yay. Because we thought the Ferrari you're, was you're right. Yeah, like, in LA, your McLaren is cool. Way cooler. But to an outsider's perspective, a Ferrari is always cooler. Is it a California King or is it not even a California King? Um, it's not the import, it's just custom. That's a lot of money. Tell, fellas, listen to me. Don't let your mask in. Ah, uh, don't let your mask. 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 Ah, oh, crap. Mascularity stop you from making this bread. Look into that um look into that skincare uh, business, alright fellas? Look into it. There's money to be made from it, I'm telling you this. Alright. But nevertheless, we're just looking at uh how much how much money the racist Jeffree Star makes, you know. Yeah, but hey, it is what it is. You know, it is what it is. But, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe, and comment all that good stuff down below in the comment section. If you guys are new to the channel, share with a friend if you laugh or if you just enjoyed the video. I don't know why I say laugh. But, remember, until we meet again, the world is yours. Peace.